All right, so a lot of the work that we do for extreme range shooting really just happens at 100 yards. Um, you can never be too confident in your 100 yard zero. That's the baseline that everything comes off of. Uh, measuring your velocities is an important thing. You know, sometimes we come out and the velocity is 10 feet a second uh, away from the average that we thought it would be. And it depends on the state of your barrel, how many rounds since you've cleaned, uh, temperature obviously. And whenever you set up for an extreme range shot, if you're shooting at a one minute target at two miles, if your velocity is different than what you think it is by even eight feet per second, that's a full minute of elevation error. That's your entire target. So you really need to know exactly what your muzzle velocity is going to be on every shot. The same that you need to know, you know, we spend a lot of time refining custom drag models for bullets and Coriolis effect, all these other things that are, you know, the primary and secondary effects on your trajectory. Um, but you can't forget the basics like muzzle velocity and at extreme range. It's so important. You know, I, I was out here yesterday. I'm out here today. I'm going to come out tomorrow and track what velocity I get on the first shot, second and third shot, uh, how it's affected by temperature and cleaning so that all that's documented. Um, I don't change my load a lot. This load that I have now uh, is the same load that I shot in the practice a couple weeks ago. Uh, I loaded a whole bunch so that I can study this batch of ammo and how it responds to different environmentals so that whenever I lay down to shoot in the match, I know for sure what velocity I need to base all of my drops on. So that's what we're doing here today is more 100 yard work. You can, you can do a lot at 100 yards if you're careful with your records and you're looking at all the right stuff. Thirty-one fifty-three and thirty-one fifty-eight. Thirty-one fifty-one, thirty-one fifty-seven. All right, how'd we do? Uh, looks pretty good. Uh, had an extreme spread of nine, and the average seems to be about the same as it was yesterday. All right, yeah, 3159, I mean, I think I was at 3157 yesterday, so it's 15 degrees warmer, didn't seem to change the average at all. Nope. And I like how consistent they are. Extreme spread of nine for four shots. I mean, that's- It'll work. Yeah, that's pretty good.